Good morning. Hello, and welcome to the Breakfast Blog on a High Gravity Monday. We do these uh, each weekday. We're supposed to. Yeah. Anyway. But, <laughs> um, so success. How would you measure success in life? People have different, uh, you know, ways of measuring success. He A lot of people the, say money. Yeah, you know, the guy with the most toys wins at the end. You know, you've heard that old cliche, but there's a study now. Yes, actually a survey from Men's Health Magazine. How do you rate your success in life? And the number one thing that men said was actually good friendships with 66% of the votes. I think there's a lot to be said about that. I think you're right, because good friends in your life really actually do make a big difference, you know? And if you got a lot of friends because you've been a pretty good person, which means you've probably done good things in your life, which means probably money to come with that so, you know, most of the time. You well, know? Sometimes, sometimes. Sometimes, anyway. <laughs> but money was actually second, a distant second, in with 12%. Responsibility and power on the list as well. Fame, a long life. Number of offspring as well. All right. Well, if it's the number of offspring, I'm doing pretty decent in that one. You're good. <laughs> well... Yeah. You know, I have to say something that didn't make the list, and maybe it's because I'm a girl, because this is Men's Health uh, magazine, but how about, like, achieving your goals in life? Does that uh, mean you're successful? Yeah, you know, like, of course, uh, I have a 54-25 and 25 record in Madden right now. There is that. I mean... Having good grass that's not dead? Grass is good. I love successful grass. Successful in the state of Florida. Well, I guess you can, uh, you know, talk about all these kinds of things until the cows come home, but anyway... That's the breakfast blog today. Posted on the Crash Show Facebook. Thanks How for visiting us. Would you rate success? How do you measure it? Like us, WJR.com. Hell, maybe it's toys. I don't know.